EA just released the new 1.6 patch. This patch is packed with a variety of changes aimed at enhancing our racing experience. Let's get into the detail of what's new and improved in this update. One of the standout aspects of this patch is the significant tweaks to handling and curb behavior. The medium traction control setting has been rebalanced, making it more user-friendly and ensuring a smoother driving experience. This change is crucial for those who prefer a balance between full traction control and having complete control over their car's handling. When it comes to curbs, especially the notorious sausage curbs, the update has made them more impactful. Cars will now react more realistically, becoming more unsettled when driven over these curbs. This adjustment is set to add an extra layer of authenticity to your racing, challenging you to adapt your driving style to maintain stability and control. Visual improvements are always a welcome addition, and this patch does not disappoint. For those playing on PS4 and Xbox One, the presentation quality of broadcast pit stops has been significantly enhanced. This means you'll experience more polished and immersive pit stop sequences, making the game feel even more like watching a real F1 broadcast. Moreover, the developers have fixed various visual issues. For instance, tire warmers clipping slightly with the tires on some cars has been resolved. Additionally, the lighting on character models of My Team icons at the beginning of a career mode has been improved. For PC players with frame generation capabilities, you'll find that this feature now works more effectively, ensuring smoother graphics performance stability and bug fixes are critical for a seamless gaming experience, and this patch addresses several key issues. One major fix involves the driver's tab, which could become unresponsive after viewing lap times in the race director. This problem has been resolved. There was also a bug where players could select two options simultaneously in the practice menu, causing the game to get stuck. This has now been fixed, ensuring a smoother and more intuitive menu navigation. Another important fix is related to time trial mode. There was an issue where time set with an F1 car could appear on the F2 leaderboards under certain circumstances. This has been corrected ensuring that leaderboard standings reflect the appropriate vehicle class. Track-specific updates are also part of this patch. At Portugal's Turn 1, a metal grate that was registering as a minor collision with passing vehicles has been fixed. Additionally, there was a rare issue in one-shot qualifying at Silverstone, where the AI could drive wide, invalidating the next lap before the player gains control. These fixes are designed to provide a more consistent and fair racing environment. In the audio department, the patch addresses an issue where your engineer could incorrectly inform you that your teammate is outperforming you. This fix ensures that you receive accurate and relevant feedback during your races. On the peripheral side, support for the Camus C5 wheel has been added. This addition is great news for those looking to switch up from the usual controller and use a more immersive racing setup. There are several miscellaneous updates that further enhance the overall gameplay experience. New Champions images have been added to the compendium, replacing previous entries while keeping all previously unlocked stickers intact. This adds a fresh visual appeal to the game's collectible elements. A notable fix is the duration of 10 second penalties during pit stops, which previously lasted only 5 seconds. This correction ensures penalties are accurately applied, maintaining fairness in races. The logo on the Ferrari garage monitors has been updated, reflecting the latest branding. Various UI improvements have been made across many areas of the game, contributing to a more polished and user-friendly interface. General stability improvements and minor fixes round out the patch, ensuring a smoother and more reliable gameplay experience. The 1.6 patch for F124 brings a host of enhancements that underscore the developer's commitment to refining the game based on community feedback. From rebalanced traction control and more realistic curb interactions to visual improvements and crucial bug fixes, there's a lot to appreciate in this update. Thanks so much for watching, and I will see you in live every day here on YouTube. Bye.